The FBI is asking for your help tonight. Take a good look at this sketch. A self-confessed serial killer claims that this Georgia woman was one of his victims, but his story does not match any official missing persons. Well, now investigators hope a Fox 5 viewer may have information to crack the case. And Fox 5's Deidre Dukes has the latest now from FBI headquarters. Samuel Little may be among the most prolific serial killers in U.S. history, according to the FBI. It's up to 93 now nationally that he's confessed to, and uh, we have seven cases that he's confessed to in the state of Georgia. The 78-year-old drew this sketch of one of the Georgia women he claims to have killed in 1983 or 84. He described her as a white female from Griffin. We want people to focus on that area, people who live in that area or have lived in that area, if they recognize this sketch or they remember any woman disappearing in those days, we'd like to hear information from. Little described the woman as being heavy set, about 260 pounds and 5 feet 8 inches tall, possibly wearing black pants. He claims she worked as a topless dancer or a prostitute in Atlanta, had a son and that he met her in an Atlanta strip club. Yeah, after he met her at the strip club, he apparently drove her in a black Thunderbird to an area, a wooded area. He described it as a big island that uh, was between two roadways, kind of a divided highway and a wooded area in between. And he says that's where he choked her out and then left her. Rosen says there are no missing persons cases matching the woman's description from that time period, but there's a good chance the woman might not have been reported as missing. He chose women who were strippers, prostitutes, so there's a good chance that some of these women that he's claimed to have killed were never reported as missing. Deidre Dukes, Fox 5 News.